All right, back again. This is the Celtic Whisper soap in the mold. I don't know if you can see that that well, the color. Probably not. You probably can't see the color real, real well. But it's already, it's gelled. It's still pretty hot. But we'll leave that tomorrow to cut. And I wanted to update you guys on the goats um, with Pearl and Bubbles. And Bubbles is the mom. Pearl's the baby. I call her baby. But anyways, um, she'll always be the baby. Just like Hercules. He's five, six years old. I still call him the baby. <laughs> uh, anyways, Pearl will be having her baby first. She was bred first and she's visible. You can see that she is a lot fuller than Bubbles is. So she's most definitely going to have the baby first. Or babies. Maybe three babies. <laughs> um, so she'll have her babies first. And we're hoping for spots like the dad. But you know what? It really doesn't matter just as long as everyone's healthy and an easy labor. That's really all that matters to me. Um, but what I learned from the breeder is that when the babies are born, they get these what's called ghost spots. So if they're going to get spots, if they're going to be spotted, they're not going to be born with the spots. They'll, um, as they get older, like I guess within a couple months, they'll start getting some really light spots, what are called ghost spots. And as they get older, those spots will... Um, I guess, I don't know, either get darker or lighter, but more visibly. As they get older, they'll be more visible. So when they're born, they're, if they're going to have spots, you won't see them until they start getting older. So just so you know, so, so you guys aren't like, oh, well, they're not going to have spots. Well, they still could have spots because they don't show up for a while. And um, they, they, the goats are pregnant for five months, for 150 days. They break up the pregnancy in 50-day um, intervals. So I guess you have like your first trimester, second trimester, third trimester type deal with the goats. And um, I would say, I believe, I had it all calculated because they have this goat pregnancy um, calculator deal. And I already put, um, I kind of guesstimated on, because we don't know exactly the date that they were bred. So I kind of guesstimated on Pearl and she should be, I'm thinking, maybe having the babies or baby um, in about two and a half months. And then the mom, I'm going to put her maybe a month behind that. So two and a half months and, let's see, June. So all of so middle of August say the middle of August we should start seeing some babies hopefully and um, as they get closer and closer to their due date I'll show you pictures and stuff and kind of how they change and how they're you know the um, they start to develop their udders and everything because this is going to be the first time for Pearl and it will be I believe the third time for her mom which is Bubbles so, anyways, I wanted to update you on that so you guys kind of know because I've had a few questions. And, um, so, there you go. And I will be making some more videos with them coming up pretty soon, too. And my next video tonight will be cutting that Honey Bunch soap, which is the honey I wash the kids do. Oh, and the other thing, too, I have my, while I have my Hoger's catalog here, um, like you guys have seen me make the cheese, you've seen me make the um, the butter. Next, I'm going to be doing for the first time yogurt, and I've already got my starter, which I got from the lady that bred the goats. I have my starter, and I just need to get my mason jars, and I'm going to do it in the oven. So that'll be next week, probably Monday. I'll do that, and I'll share that with you guys. So. You guys can see how I'm going to do it and how it turns out. So wish me luck on that. <laughs> Alright, I will see you guys in a little bit for the soap cutting.